G'day, it's Graham here. Just expanding on Andy's request to be able to pop up images in a in an article. So I've retrieved Andy's article where he's tried creating pop-ups with images and I've upgraded some software so now you can. So here's a picture of the earth. Here it's 200 by 200 pixels. But if you click on it, it will expand to a 500 by 500 pixel pop-up box. And you can also change this caption down the bottom as well. To add this functionality to your article, open up your article. While it's possible to add this functionality to older images on the site, it's a lot easier just to do it with new images. So re-upload them and follow the process I'm about to show you. So with that in mind, I'm going to delete the old image and open up the image manager. Navigate to the directory that I want to go to and I'm going to re-upload my picture. So it's down here in the queue box. We've got some options now, uh, resize, rotate and thumbnail. Resize and rotate, they do what they mean. Thumbnail is the important one for this. And I can change the size of the thumbnail. In this case, I'm going to make it 200 pixels. I'm going to leave it at 80% quality and leave the mode on proportional. So now that I've enabled thumbnails in those settings, I can upload. And once it's completed, click on close. I'm going to select that image. Uh, it tells me the original size is 500 by 500. However, I want to create or use the thumbnail. So I will click on the pop-up tab and click enable. Select the image from this window and you'll be presented with this confirm box. Use the associated thumbnail. In this case, yes. And now you can change some options for the pop-up box itself. Compatibility, leave it on the default option. Caption, I'm going to change this to large earth group so you can create an album. Uh, this is handy if you've got several different images in the article itself. If they all have the same group name then little arrows will appear on, on the left and left and right hand side to allow you to change between different pictures in that album. And icon, this is a little uh, magnifying glass that, that'll appear on the thumbnail itself. So I'm going to select top right. Click on insert and you can see the image is loaded here. Now that my image is in the article, I can click on save and you can see the image now presents itself as the thumbnail. So you'll see the icon up the top right, the magnifying glass, and if I click on this, it goes through a small animation to say it's loading and it will open up the larger image. And here's the caption down the bottom that I've changed to large earth. So yeah, that's pretty easy to do and you can add it to as many images as you want in your article. Don't forget that all the other functionalities still exist, such as padding, border, the alignment, so you can move it around. And to change any of those settings, you can do it back in the image manager. That's about it with images. If you have any other ideas or feature requests, let me know.